What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nye, and I'm back with another mother freaking video. This is something that's going to be like really big and I'm sorry if y'all hear me echoing but basically right now we are sitting inside of what is going to be my nail studio. If you guys haven't already checked out my first day of cosmetology school you guys will not know that your girl really wants to be a nail tech on her own like I want to run a business at my house one day a storefront i don't know but this is the beginning of it and we are in the making of the room this video is just going to be for you guys to see the process and this will be considered day one of the room construction so i'm gonna show you guys a little bit of the room so it's just you know pretty basic regular there's a window right there so so far what i did Furniture wise, I got my desk, I got a drawer, just like an organizer. It's not everything yet. And we did go out and get paint. This is white paint. But we did end up going to Ikea four times just this week alone. We went to Ikea back to back to back to back to back. And I even went by myself. And we ended up getting two chairs, which is why I am recording because I'm gonna try to put them up tonight. It is currently 11.10 it's monday it's 11 10 you guys can't even see it but it's 11 10 it's monday june 7th and i just literally came home from school and i'm about to get right into this and i can't really do too much of it because i have work in the morning so i'm gonna try to bust it out as much as i possibly can oh and speaking of you guys i was looking for somebody to do my logo and i really do appreciate the people who did reach out to me and help me with the logo but i ended up making one so don't let me forget to show you guys what it looks like and i'll probably leave it on the screen or something but i made my logos myself for my nail business i'm so excited and literally right now i'm doing schoolwork for my nails and that's a whole nother story time in itself but let's just get into this i'm sorry if the lighting is like off i on replacing this light because it's not really a lot of light in here and if i'm gonna be doing nails i need to see what i'm doing so put you guys right here so number one wait where is number one? Oh, number one's right there. <laughs> Alright, you guys. So, first chair is done. Alright, y'all. So, the first chair is done. It really didn't take that long. 11.47. So, it took me like 40 minutes. It wasn't bad. That's actually the quickest I've ever put anything together. Now it's time to open up the other box. Get that started so I can go to bed. Last time you see me, you guys, I was doing chairs. And I stayed up until like 1 o'clock in the morning. Putting together chairs from Ikea. Knowing I had work the next day. But we got the chairs done. So today, as you guys can see, there is a paint thingy thing. As you guys can tell, I'm getting ready to paint the room. Yes, I look busted. Do not come at me. But you know, this is the process. We're going to trust the process. We talked to somebody today to get flooring. Because as you guys can see there's carpet down we're going to rip the carpet up and then we're going to have home depot come in and install some vinyl flooring so it looks nice in here i'm painting the walls today white i gotta put down the plastic tarp so we don't get any paint on anything else i don't have to tape the perimeter of the walls because i'm painting everything white okay so right now it is 6 19 um we're gonna say like i'll say like 8 30 9 o'clock i'll be done hopefully you guys if this video is all over the place i'm sorry you guys just gonna have to trust the process today has been a hectic day i was supposed to start this at six in the morning and i'm starting at six at night so it is what it is so i'm gonna lay the tarp down real quick Ugh. all right you guys it's about to get serious <laughs> yeah y'all so y'all see the bun I'm gonna lay the tarp
And you would think because it's white, it doesn't need mixing, but it's going to need mixing. Oh, be careful that you don't spill it on the sides. All right, you guys, so you'll never guess what time it is. It is nowhere near 8.30. It is actually 10.09 right now. Um, can't even see it, but it's 10.09. And for the most part, we actually have a really good amount covered. So this is what we're looking like right now. We're gonna have to get another thing of paint because it wasn't enough. And as you guys can see, I am all painted up, okay? But yeah, that's what we did so far. We gotta come back tomorrow and paint. This wall right here looks really, really good. And then this little piece of the wall looks good too. But we still have the top of over there, the top of over there, and then the ceiling to do. So yeah, we're probably gonna do the top of the wall and the full wall one more time and then maybe wait for the ceiling because that's gonna be a lot. And we still have to get a whole thing of paint. I have paint literally everywhere. The next day. All right, you guys, so we are back. Day number two. And we got more paint. There's paint in there. Y'all don't look at my toes, y'all weird. Anyway, so we got paint in there in there yesterday y'all we was embarrassed we was using these little things so we was using these yesterday y'all because the big one broke so we ended up using these little things but we did a little we did a lot actually for using the small ones yeah so now we're gonna get ready to paint two weeks later what's up you guys so today is saturday june 26 because it's, it's 12 1 right now and i'm extremely tired but I just want to give you guys a quick update because I feel like I haven't given you guys an update in quite a minute. As you guys can see, all of the walls are now white, as well as the trim, the door, and that door over here is white as well, which it was once white, but now it matches the wall. Then, as you guys can see, the floor is no longer carpet. The floor was once this this gray carpet color. Me, my grandma, and my grandpa had just ripped up the carpet. And I just want to show you guys some of the things that I got today from Walmart. So I just want to show you guys these ball edges that I got. I got two of them, which two comes in a pack. So I got two of them, so it makes four of them. And I want to hang them up against this wall right here. It's probably where all of my gel polishes are gonna go. I'm not sure just yet, but we're gonna see. Next thing that I got from Walmart was this calendar. But there's a whiteboard, just two whiteboards, and then this so you could pin like things into it. And then I bought a TV. So I got a 32 inch TV, which is gonna get hung on this wall. And my grandma gave me this, which this is a mounter. Um, and then I got some of these like award thingies because I did take a course on barberside and stuff like that that has to be put up into a frame there's still a lot of stuff that i have to get as well then i got some more things so this stuff just markers for the whiteboard and then i got these little collapsible storage bins i got three of them this one is a smaller one it fits like half of it and then i got another big one it's just black whatever and the last thing i got today with these pins just to use for the driver's room. So I don't know what I'm gonna get next just yet for the room, but we did talk to Lowe's and Home Depot to see about flooring arrangements. And so far, Home Depot seems to be out of it because it's just not, it's just not it. Like they weren't gonna rip up the carpet, so we ripped up the carpet. Then they wanna charge really expensive prices. So we're looking at Lowe's right now. So I'm gonna get back to you guys, but I do have a template of what the floor will look like. So I'll show you that in a second. So just imagine like this and this. I think it's gonna look like top notch. Like I think it looks really good. 
just as it is right now but this whole floor covered in it it's amazing but yeah you guys i just wanted to give you guys a little bit more of a update because i feel like i haven't been doing that a lot of you have been asking me where i've been at what i've been doing and i know you guys i've been slacking but trust and believe even though you guys may think i'm slacking and it might be a little bit of slack but i've been putting in so much work in every other area of my life that i've been trying to get myself together so i can get onto my own i don't want to like currently i'm still in my parents household and i feel like i've reached this point where i know well i have an idea of what i want to do with my life i have an idea of where i want to go from here and i can't be living underneath my parents household like i can't be doing that my whole entire life you know and this is like a moment where i want to take you guys with me so i can look back at this and be like damn like i could do things on my own you know i've been really like thinking and reevaluating my life and things that I want to do and of course I'm gonna keep you guys like in the loop of things it might not be when you guys want it but what can I say my timing isn't even my own timing because everything works by God's timing so at this point I've really just been trying to go with the flow and still trust God in the process because if you don't then you're just just gonna rush things and things aren't gonna go how you want it to but there's nothing wrong with trying to get an idea and definitely trying to figure out where you are at at that particular moment in time and right now i have so many different things going on you guys like i want to do a sit down and talk with you guys because i haven't done those in a while and i feel like the last time i did it it wasn't like enough for me but just so you guys have a heads up of where i've been at i'm okay right now mentally a few weeks ago i wasn't so it's like uh, but i've been at school i've been trying to get this business going i've been busting my ass at work you know so that's really where i've been um there's more to it but camera's about to die so i love you guys so so much and i'll get back to you when i can three weeks later love youtube we back let's say today is july 5th we just went to ikea which i probably should have brought y'all with me but i forgot about it so my bad, that's on me. But I don't know what I said the last time I seen you guys because it's been a hot minute. But we got a shelf and another shelf. And the other one is downstairs. And then we got paintings, which I think I told y'all about. And then I got a cart on oh, sale. Did I already tell y'all I got a TV? If I didn't, there's a TV. But we are about to mount the TV. I've never mounted a TV before, you guys, so I don't know what to do. This is exciting. This part goes up on the wall, and when we use a stud finder and you mark it at, that's yeah. where these would go. Because you need the stud for to hold the TV, you need wood. Because plywood's not gonna hold it. You have a leveler? Yeah, I have that downstairs too with the drill. We have a stud finder, drill bit, hammer, got that. Electric drill, electric drill downstairs. We have a pencil, tape measure. Tape measure over there. Socket wrench. That, I don't have to get that. We are so unprepared. Yes. You're right, we are, and I wasn't prepared for this. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna get back to y'all when we're actually like doing something because we still have to get the tools and stuff. Five minutes later. Did you know I'd walk a thousand miles by good just say yeah. And I wanna put a little In is to the left. All right, let's do this. Go in straight. Right here, right? Yep. I did it! It's so nice! The next morning. What's up, guys? So today is Tuesday, July 6th. And so far, we put the TV up, you guys. But this is my first ever time putting the TV on the wall. I've never done that before. But me and my grandma put this up yesterday. And y'all, I almost forgot to show y'all because it probably looked better at nighttime. But I put my LED lights back there. 
y'all see it changing it's probably gonna look better at nighttime but oh my god what about fell off but i just secured them on the back like that but I'm probably gonna have to get some more sticky stuff to put on there. Right now it is 12:19, and your girl was thinking about opening up one of these packages that we got yesterday. I got this thing, which is just like one of them shelves from Ikea. It's a long shelf and it just has like storage on the side. I'm kind of upset because I can't do anything like for real, for real, because I have to leave at like 1 because I have school at 2.30 today. I don't know how long this is going to take. Oh my gosh, you guys. So I also got, I got this. This is a shelf. It's supposed to go underneath the TV, which I'll give you guys a quick little glimpse of. But the shelf is supposed to go here, like, like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all. So I got that shelf as is for thirteen dollars because the package was open, and it wasn't open, open like you lose stuff. It was open just accidentally. I really don't even have that much time. I'll probably come home and do it like tonight, cause I get home at like eleven. My lips are so ashy. I'm so sorry. Y'all. I at least want to open up the box. I feel like this isn't gonna take that long. If we're being honest, I really don't think it's gonna take forever to get this. All right, I'm gonna open. Here's all the panels. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven panels. All right, we got bolts, joint panels. This is what it looks like, you guys. Simple. All right, y'all. Here's the setup. Long thing, seven of these things, instructions. Let's just make this quick. All right, this is easy. This is not that complicated, you guys. I don't know if you can see, but so far I got this one on and I feel very confident about myself right now. All right, guys, so that's the last one, and I finished at 12.41. I'm um, still debating if I want it like this and have it attached to the wall, or if I want it like this and it's not attached. I feel like that looks better. All right, but I'll get back to you guys probably later on tonight. 24 hours later. What's up, y'all? So, today's July 7th. So far, you guys, we got the TV up. I believe I showed y'all that. Then I also got that. I built that yesterday. The walls are painted white since the last time we talked about that. Then I'm going to start on this box. So, that's what today is looking like. <sighs> This has been a progress, you guys, and I'm so glad that I can bring you guys with me through this whole thing. I'm gonna come back to y'all when I get my water and I start building. All right, y'all, so I'm back, I'm ready. All right, oh. so this is what the box looks like. There is two boxes to this whole thing, but I'm pretty sure I don't need to have both of them present right this second. But if I do, I could always just go downstairs and go get it. All right, so I got it open. So this is what we got so far. This is what it looks like. second box which is everything that we just did we're just gonna be doing it all over again i'll put you guys back here all right you guys so we got it all and right now my mom is drilling the holes to put the floating shelf up that's what we're looking like 
a little longer than a few minutes later. Y'all have run into one of our dilemmas. This happened yesterday. We were trying to put up the shelf and we didn't have any more screws for it. But we went and got screws and now they don't fit either. So we're trying to figure out what we can do. But y'all can see we got the storage unit up. We're going to see. So I'm going to hit y'all when we figure something out. Two hours later. We figured it out. Oh, I see where that little chip is. Not gonna do. I'm scared it's gonna fall. Mm -mm. Oh, it actually looks good. All right, yay! Okay, oh cool, it's a